Welcome back to Upper Michigan today. We are having a blast here with exec certified executive chef Nathan Molesky. Uh, we're making our own Yoop Coop sauces for the second time. Tia's trying to perfect. You, you're still kind of working on yours over she there. added some spice to it. I did. Oh, were you going to try that? No, go ahead. Oh, okay. I have so, the technology to do it. Yeah. You're happy? Or are you still? You're still going to let it sit. What's oh, better? Yeah. I'm going to let it sit. Okay. Yeah. So I, 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 mine's a jalapeno honey mustard. I'm first go. I feel real happy about it, but I thought I should just try a different concoction just in case. Got Why it. not? Yeah. yeah. Mine, mine is spicy. I said I wanted to make mine spicy. It first hits you with um, that kind of like sweet stickiness. Yeah. And then you get the spice on the back of your tongue afterwards. Let's just put a little salt. Yeah. On. Why not? Yep. And remind me salt what the base does amazing of amazing things. Salt. Yep. What the base of your, of Tia's is again? It's a citrus soy sauce. Oh yeah, citrus soy. Yep. So the the base is kind of sweet in itself. Correct. I feel like I don't know if you if you a bit of sugar in dip there. your chicken nuggets in sweet and sour sauce, but you also like spicy. This may, may, this might be a yeah. decent option. Trying to like find you know who who this might oh. sauce might be good for. There's a one of the big restaurant tours. You know, global 10 billion served is doing a lot of Asian sauces right now, mm -hmm. and that's very similar to one of them I've had. Oh. Okay. Okay. It was good. Do you have a lot of your customers ask for specific sauces or make requests or give you ideas? Like, where do you, where do you find the inspiration for for these sauces? Yeah. Sauces? So it's either a, a team effort or people come in. Like the sweet and sour uh, came to be and. Unfortunately, it came and went, but um, <laughs> that was a customer suggestion. Um, and then the Maple Waffle was Chris, uh, our owner's last minute request. And that's become one of the most popular sauces we have. It's like a real sweet. Real sweet. Yeah. Um, but we find that people are taking the sweet ones and mixing mm -hmm. them with the, the hotter ones. Ah. So they'll find a combination that they really like. So they might take Super Ranch and mix it with buffalo, or they might take Super Ranch and mix it with mango habanero lime. Okay. It's, it's, it's interesting. And some are very straightforward. Uh, we had a customer the other day. It's Thai pesto and Thai pesto only. Mm -hmm. So it, Every time. It, yeah, yeah. Some are adventurous. Some, some aren't. So. Mm -hmm. Um, the the yoop and the coop. Yoop is always number one. That's a, a mustard-based sauce. It's my favorite. Yeah, coop is right up there. But um, the BBQ and uh, the I'm trying to think what else. The honey mustard is real popular as well. Oh really? Yeah. Well, get ready. So now you're getting. Get you ready. gotta run. Yeah. Give that one a run. Yeah. For it's money with that. Jalapeno. I'm taking your yeah. honey mustard experience <laughs> up a notch. Jalapeno popper. So. Oh, that's right. I, yep. Earlier, when we first started chatting with you, you mentioned you had to pare down some of your yeah. sauces. You have 16 now. Yeah. So wh what are some of the ones that you had to get rid of besides um, what you already told us? Yeah, sweet and sour was one of them. Um, General's chicken, that mm -hmm. just, it was interesting. It did really well at first and then yeah. kind of tapered off. I think because you can get that at other, other places. People come in for more of the unique things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, for the yoop fair. sauce, the yeah, coop yeah. sauce. So you're not going to get that anywhere Correct. else. Yeah. Um, and then we had some products discontinued, um, so we, hmm. the base is so we didn't move on. Uh oh. Because your that that one looks very different colors. So yeah. did you do a different base on that one? I added different a couple different things. Oh, how's it? That one's really sweet. Yeah, I don't like it as much. Really sweet. <laughs> yeah, see that face? That's what. <laughs> really when, sweet. When my when. When the That's not a good face they'll, they'll from the you. chef. Yeah. They'll tell you my yeah. face. They know, like, I can't, I don't have a poker face when it comes to So you'd to that. go this one? Absolutely. Yep. That, that one just needs a little work. Maybe a little more mustard or something. It's spicier. It is spicier. I put a lot spicier. Yeah, I know. It's, it kind of gets spicier like, as you go. This is like two, three ish. You're, you're getting up to four ish over there. Do you want to try this? It's not very mustard, mustardy. It's not. I'll try it. Super honey, honey. -y. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Kind of spicy. You like spicy. I do like spicy. I love your little baby test of this one because you're scared of the mustard. <laughs> she's I like know. pretending she's tasting it essentially. I know. I'm like this. <laughs> it's gonna drip on you. I have an apron on. <laughs> but it's sweet. I, I still For one drop taste was that sweet. Mustard. I still taste the mustard in it. Yeah, you can. Yeah. You can. I can't believe you don't like mustard. Another God, your list is getting long, gal. Yeah, you know me. I do, I do. All right, let's take another break as I think 
Cooper. It's, a, it's about that time. This is what we do, yeah. yeah. Um, and we want to talk to you about some other things that you have going on sure. as well. So we'll be right back.